Hello everyone, let's get information about life cycle of glass vase. The content is about introduction, life cycle of product, environmental impact, conclusion, and references. Let's start. Firstly, about introduction. Overview of product. Bath Aqua Glass specializes in producing high-quality, handcrafted glassware. Using traditional glass blowing techniques, such as free blowing and hand shaping. Glass vases are available in a range of shapes and sizes. Many of their vases feature bold, bright colors, such as deep blues and rich greens, as well as intricate patterns and textures. One unique aspect of Bath Aqua Glass is their commitment to sustainability. Next is history of product. The oldest recorded glass is 2500 BC in the form of solid beads and amulets. Glassmakers were making vessels even before the invention of glassblowing in Mesopotamia and Egypt on pre-Roman 1500 BC. The Roman Empire brought a development to glassmaking 50 BC with the invention of glassblowing in the Mediterranean region. Over time, glassblowing techniques evolved, and new styles and forms of glassware were developed. In the modern era, glass vases have continued to be popular in decorations. Bath Aqua Glass has become known for its innovative designs and techniques. Bath Aqua Glass got inspiration from a variety of sources such as nature, art, and architecture to create unique and eye-catching designs. Next is company and designers. Company names Bath Aqua Glass. Bath Aqua Glass was founded in 2013. The story begins with the designer's passion for glassblowing. The studio specializes in creating handcrafted glassware. The studio was located in the city of Bath, England. It also has contact details with email and phone number. Design names Catherine Green. She first discovered glassblowing while studying at the University of Sunderland, where she earned a degree in glass and ceramics. After completing her studies, she went on to work for several glassblowing studios in the UK, honing her craft and developing her unique style. In 2013, Catherine decided to start her own glassblowing studio, Bath Aqua Glass, in the city of Bath. Seconds is about life cycle of product. The life cycle of a glass vase in Bath Aqua Glass can be divided into several stages, which means in process gate to grave, including the production, distribution, use stage, and end of life. At the production stage, the raw material is melted and collected at the end of the pipe to be blown and anneal in the layer oven to form a vase. In melting raw materials causes of 75% carbon dioxide and 40.3% nitrogen oxides release. The raw material used in particular is recycled glass. Below process in production starts with gathering raw materials, shapes, decoration, annealing layer, finishing and last process quality control before market after production the product already to sales in online and offline products purchased by customers will be safely packed using the best quality packaging the product will be delivered to the customer causing 11 percent of carbon dioxide emissions with the use of fossil fuels in transportation to move the product in using the stage, it is the customer's right to use it. Usually glass vase is used as display, decorative items to display on a shelf, table, or other surface at home or office. Flower arrangements, used for holding and displaying flowers. Storage, small items such as pens, pencils, or other desk accessories. For Bath Aqua Glass, this product is more about recycling and reuse to avoid disposal to reduce environmental impact. Sulfur dioxide, 37% of decomposition, can contribute to acidification. Therefore, decomposition is not recommended. Next, let's take a look at the inventory of the products. There are approximately 50 types of glass vases sold at Bath Aqua Glass that have their own uniqueness in terms of shape, color, pattern, accessories, and also different price. Thirds about environmental impact. Potential environmental impact can happen on every stage. Below, some environmental impact of glass vase. Smog potential global warming potential, acidification potential, and particle release.
Melting the raw materials down produces carbon dioxide, 75% a contributor to smog. A glass furnace has to run 24 7 and can't be stopped or cooled down during its lifetime. 11% of carbon dioxide use in transportation by using fossil fuels to move the product can cause climate change and risks become a global warming. Sulfur dioxide 37% and nitrogen oxides 40.3% due to the decompositions and high melting temperatures of sulfate, also nitrogen compounds. In the batch materials also contribute to acidification. Evaporation from the molten glass and raw materials can cause release of particles into the atmosphere. Then, about mitigation. Bath Aqua Glass is committed to sustainability and minimizing the environmental impact, which are use of recycled glass, eco-friendly packaging, durable and reusable, and recyclable. Use of recycled glass, Bath Aqua Glass encourages in using more type of recycled glass to make vases, which reduces the amount of virgin materials needed for production and diverts waste from landfills. Eco-friendly packaging, Bath Aqua Glass encourages eco-friendly packaging materials to minimize waste and reduce its carbon footprint. Durable and reusable means can be used for many years and do not need to be replaced as frequently as other types of decoration. Recyclable Glass is 100% recyclable, which means glass vase reaches the end of its useful life. It can be recycled and turned into new glassware, reducing the need for new materials. Last but not least, let's look about conclusion. It's cover about conclusions and recommendations. In conclusion, all Bath Aqua Glass glassware and jewelry is handcrafted in the studio. Using recycled glass, sustainability is one of the uniqueness of the studio to reduce the impact on the environment. Here are some recommendations for producing glass vases, which are use high-quality materials, use eco-friendly practices, focus on design and aesthetics, and ensure durability and safety. Use high-quality materials. This includes using high-grade sand, soda ash, and limestone to make the glass, as well as any additional materials used for decoration or color. While, use eco-friendly practices, means using energy-efficient equipment and implementing other sustainable practices in the production process can help reduce the overall environmental impact of producing glass vases. Focus on design and aesthetics. Consider the shape, color, and size of the vase, as well as any additional decorative element. Lastly, ensure durability and safety properly annealed and free from defects break or shatter. Any decorative elements used be securely attached and free. Let's move to the last content, which is reference. Here are some references from the website, journals, and YouTube about Bath Aqua Glass. Thank you for listening.